something that says that Marshall is being proactive. Definitely, because he went down with with April when he, April was babysitting him to get her math book, and April was being choked. Yeah, she was being choked by some guy that wasn't actually inside Egypt. She was, she was actually inside Egypt. Marshall, there, this is like the fence. April was over here, and then Marshall was over here, and this guy came and was like grabbing April, and and like totally like she had she was struggling to get air to her lungs. He, he was gra he was grabbing her like this. Yeah, and he threw her backwards. Too. Yeah, and like Mar they took um, but the professor actually yelled help, and then the police got them and took them to the station, and Marshall told them that. It wasn't the professor. The professor was the one who yelled, help. Yeah, because the professor actually saw what happened. He broke open a win he broke home open a window um his window with the room and he screamed help. Yeah, I mean and he, he, not what we thought. Because Mar Marshall was like terrified. Yeah, Marshall to death. He said I mean, his words you were like stuck. you were I mean you're witnessing kind of like a, an attempt at murder, right? Yeah. You're he's like he's um he's speechless and then April I mean how people do you can't scream? talk. How do you scream if you have like hands around your neck? Yeah, people like, can't talk. But um, but I Marshall think, told I them what the murderer, what the murderer looked like, and, um, and it was Schmidt, Schmidt stalking boy, stalk boy. Yeah. I mean, we heard about him earlier. We never suspected him. I mean, seriously, we did the thing that everyone does in books. We suspected the main character. It's like, and then the person who be least expected was the one who was the Yeah, and of course we um, we're assuming that um, the murder also um, this guy, Mr. Schmidt's um, stock boy was also the guy that killed your little girl and the little Because he could also come, yeah, the little boy the year before. Because that also kind of explains it. But that that does explain. He, he did confess to that. But I think it's like crazy because he did. He targeted April. I know. But like Marshall was being really proactive. Especially for like saying that the professor was not the one who did anything. The professor actually saved them. I think he was being very proactive because if he didn't do that, it'd end up with. Um, a mentally crazy yeah, man. person on a list. I mean, and and, just, and and the professor in jail or on in like a trial without like without it even being the professor. The professor actually saving April. Yeah, so I think it was very proactive for him to do that. And the hero. at first he was also being proactive. He was like saying no to most of the questions because he didn't want to give a secret away. I mean, what four year old does that? Yeah. And I think he just wanted to talk to April because April, he kind of um, trusted or liked April more than yeah these people. And also, I think he's being proactive by letting go of security. That's he let go of security. I mean, seriously, he did, he used to actually like he he didn't put him on a stool when he was going running or whatever. He actually kept him with him all the time. And now and he started now leaving security at home and he, he only he only uses him to sleep. But I think it's very proactive because he's four but he's like very mature for his age. And that means that he shouldn't be carrying a stuffed animal around too much. Yeah, and he's like I mean, through this whole book we're almost done with it. But through this whole book it's just been about like we did didn't have Marshall without security. We didn't have security without a Marshall. And when security disappeared, Marshall was like, no, you know. Yeah. He, he wasn't the same Marshall they knew. He was he was like a anxious, annoying four-year-old kid. Yeah, normal four-year-old. So that, that wraps it up, right? Yep. Yeah. Bye. I think, bye. I think Marshall will grow up to be very mature because, right? I mean, as a four-year-old, look how he is. Yeah.